Look at this! What is this? Can I scan it? Large bulb bush? Okay, can we... We can! I got a bulb bush! I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. Where is it? It's right here. Ooh, it's huge. Can we eat it? We can! What up, peeps? Welcome back for some more hot underwater subnautica action. Thanks very much for coming to hang out with me today. If you find yourselves enjoying the video, please don't forget to show your support and smash the thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel, peeps, don't forget to subscribe as well. In the end of the last episode, we heard all about Life Pod 6, which I think is over there. And the reason I say that is if you come over here and you check the data bank, uh, I think it's under data downloads. Aurora Survivors Life Pod 6 somewhere in here, maybe? Uh, perhaps not. Man, I can't remember where it is, but it's right here. Life Pod 6. Coordinates corrupted. Yeah, yeah. Pre recorded this. Dis yeah, exactly. This is Life Pod 6. I have a passenger on board. Coordinates attached. We've landed a kilometer from the crash site, but there's radiation in between us and the rendezvous. Request immediate assistance. Six out. And there you go. So, it's in here somewhere, and I saw it. I just don't remember where it is. But it actually gives us a little bit of a, a bit of a history there, and it says that it's uh, 100 meters deep in some red grass kind of deal. And just given the information about it being, a, you know, about a kilometer away from the crash site uh, and radiation in between it and the rendezvous, I'm thinking it's this way because... The rendezvous point was over there, and this is in between there, so I'm thinking it's, like, right over there. So, I thought in today's episode we would go ahead and check that out, but before we do, uh, we have to address some issues. And the issue, the main issue that's going to have to be addressed is, um, I may have made a mistake. A uh, big, big, big mistake. Uh, big, huge mistake. And I know anybody that's a, a long-time fan of the channel should not be overly surprised that I have made a mistake. Uh, what I've made the mistake with is uh, there is a vital piece of equipment we should have been carrying around with us for a long time now. Well, maybe not a long time, but a decent amount of time. Uh, and that is the laser cutter. Now, here's my problem with the laser cutter. It's going to take two diamonds. That's my only real big problem. I've got some crash powder here. We're going to need that. I'm going to have to make another battery, so that's going to take uh, a couple of shrooms. Some acid shrooms and... Uh, some copper. Now, where is my copper? Uh, I'm just going to grab up all the materials that we're going to need right now. Two shrooms and a copper is going to make a battery. We're going to replace the battery in the Sea Glide, uh, which will allow us to do the laser cutter. Now, I need two diamonds and a little tiny piece of titanium, which is right here. All right, ladies and gentle peeps. If we come up here and we go get head inside of here and we make ourselves a battery... There we go, and then we're going to bring out this, we're going to bring up the battery, replace with a good battery, shut off the light, awesome, put it away. Now we can go ahead, and ladies and gentle peeps, we can make a laser cutter. Now, are we going to get description? Nothing? Alexa didn't, doesn't tell us a bloody thing. Uh, that's disappointing, I have to say. So now we have a laser cutter, uh, and we have this other thing, the habitat builder. I'm actually going to leave the habitat habitat builder behind because I don't see a reason to just carry it around forever so the other thing that we're going to need to get involved with in order to be able to check this out is we're going to have to check out this radiation suit which is two fiber mesh and two lead now do we have we have one fiber mesh okay we might have more down here and I have gone ahead and I have rearranged our storage a little bit uh two fiber mesh I don't I have silicone rubbers um, and I need a, oh, no, escape, copper, locker, locker, okay, and two lead. Uh, so we're going to need a, a silicone mesh. Uh, in order to get the silicone mesh, we need, it's the nighttime, I actually really like it in the nighttime. Uh, we're going to have to head over here, I think it's over here, let me see, whoa, maybe not, oh, I thought I was going to get a jump out of that, I'm disappointed. Um. We have to head over to what I think is right over here, and that's the kelp, one of the kelp forests. 
Yeah, here we go. Right over here, you can see it. It's all over the place. Uh, we're going to have to take our knife and we just go one and two and three and four. There, that should be enough for us to be able to make our fiber mesh. I believe that's a little bladder fish that we're going to need later on. Um, I believe that's what we need in order to make the radiation suit. Uh, are we going in the wrong direction? We are uh, lost. Again, anyone that's been a, a fan of the channel or following the channel for any period of time knows that when I play video games, uh, or just in general, I get lost. I'm not the greatest with the directions. So, let's get this suit made up so that we can check it out. Do we have a thing? We have a thing! Okay. Let's check it out. What a weird one. Signal location uploaded to PDA. All right, so Life Pod 12, 250 meters down, sunk to the ocean bed. It's a decent ways away. We'll check that out in a minute. Let's have a look at this radiation suit. So we need a fiber mesh. Can I have one fiber mesh, please? Thank you very much. And this is going to allow us to make the radiation suit. And nailed it. All right, so we've got it. Radiation helmet, rebreather helmet. Ooh. Ooh, so it's going to make us pick? Decomposing. Oh, we better turn this into um, fiber mesh. Okay. Now we've got an extra fiber mesh lying around. Okay, let me back in here. Yuck. Um, hmm. What am I going to do here? So this fiber mesh has to stay. I'm going to leave the bladder fish here. We're going to have to wear the radiation helmet. At least for the time being. So do I have a spot where I can just squirt uh, our other guy here? Copper. No. No. Crystal. Crystal. Yes. There we are. Crystal. There should be enough room in the crystal bin. Like so. Uh, okay. So we don't forget where that's, that's where that is. So now we have the radiation suit. So we're going to be able to go ahead and try and head over to Life Pod 6. Uh... Okay, that's all fine and dandy. Oh, wow. I think Life Pod 12 and Life Pod 6 are basically in the same direction. Let's go check this out and see what happens. Okay, Life Pod 6. And we're going up. Very nice. Okay. So, 6. Oh, I see... Okay, so here's the red grass. I hear some... Uh, Oh, it's, it's, it's Kevin and Jessica! Ladies and gentle peeps, Kevin and Jessica. The reef back's just floating around over there. Okay, so Life Pod 6, uh, I'm thinking, oh, what do we have here? Looks like bioreactor stuff. Sand shark freaking out as per the norm. Is this bioreactor? It is. We really don't want it, but we'll take it anyway. Okay. Now, Life Pod 6, where could you possibly be? There's a debris field. So it said it was one kilometer from the crash site, or from the rendezvous site. A rendezvous location. Oh, there it is. Okay, we've, uh, we found it. Oh, there's those silly, silly squirrels, the shoot, shoot th deals that like to shoot us, and I don't like them very much. There's a wreck over here for us to check a bunch of scans out too. Four. So, all right. Hang on. Life Pod 6. Here it is. It's the daytime. I actually don't think we're in here. Yep. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Crew log. Ma'am, I need you to stay calm. We're not in immediate danger. Where are lead. the rescue teams? The Aurora didn't make it. So, where are the rescue teams? They're dead, ma'am. We have rendezvous coordinates, but the routes are radiated. So, what are you going to do? I'm head of human resources, ma'am. This is not my expertise. But the PDA says if we can find some lead, we can make radiation suits. Oh, there! I am not setting foot outside this life pod without the proper protection. Don't worry. I'll go. 
Well, that's very nice of our head of HR just uh, willing to, to do some adventuring like that. Let's grab this PDA. So we have Life Assault Pod 6, Crew Log 2. PDA data. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you, Kaylee. Eric Carly. All right, so I want to play Crew Log number 2. And we'll go check out this... Uh, I was going to try and attract someone's attention. That's not a distress flare. Stop winding it around like that. You'll catch the fuel line. Oh, really? That's how it ends for them? The fuel line? That seems like it's a bit of crap. Okay. Uh, here's a nice little outcropping here. Did we scan these already? Yeah, we did. So, sandstone. We get silver. Very... Ouch! 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 What, uh, what's not so nice? What, uh... Oh, it's you. You, it's you. Okay. Uh, let's see. So we've got a, a bit of a wreck here. Uh, okay, fish. And let's uh, let's get the repair done. Okay, repair is complete. Now, what do we have over here? What are you? Scanner room fragment. I believe we already have the scanner room. We do. Okay. What else do you got? What's this? Bioreactor fragment. Well, we gotta we gotta pick this stuff up, right? So we got life pod six. That's uh, that's secure and out of the way. We may as well keep on going and grab twelve as well. Uh, I just want to have a go around here. What is this? Metal salvage? Not so much. Make sure that we have all of the things. Huh, is this just a... A missed opportunity? It is just a missed opportunity. What a shame. I thought there'd be, uh, you know, something a little more, a little more in there. Metal salvage. Metal nothing. Sand shark freaking out again. Yeah, okay. Calm down, big guy. Calm down. You're okay. You're okay. No one wants to play. You're all good. There goes a little lead. All right, let's see. Hmm. I think that's about it. Let's grab the sea moth. What was that? Now, I did notice something when we were looking at Life Plod 12. So let's head back over. Look at that. Why didn't I see this stuff? What do we have here? A forklift? No, nope, won't let us scan it. To bar table, yes, please, ladies and gentle peeps. Another message, man. We're the messaging people today. Okay. Need a blueprint acquired. A blueprint required. Acquired, I should say. More lead. Okay. I think that's about it for now. Let's uh, let's hop in the life po or in the sea moth yet again, and let's head over to number twelve. Oh no, I know I want to. Uh, six. Where was life pod six? Over here, was it? I don't remember where 6 was. Oh, it's right there. Okay, so Life Pod 6 is there. This was the debris field. I did notice something way over there. Yeah, there's a, there's a big, huge wreck over there. Massive, massive wreck. Hmm. Scanner room again. Yeah, this is, this is big. Okay. Kind of want to get to that other Life Pod. Have we been here already? I, I, I almost want to say we've been here already. It looks like we have. Because there's just almost nothing outside this wreck unless all the stuff to find is actually inside. What do we have here? What are you? What are you? Scanner room fragment. We've already done that. Scanner room fragment. We've done that. So, the scanner room is a thing. We are going to have to get into a base build. Um, one of the, the big things in my comment section is, uh, someone saying it's time to get into a bigger base, so that might be something that we have to go ahead and do. Now I'm just gonna come inside here and see what's, what's what. More water, okay. Oh boy, here we go. Is there nothing here? Oh, does it go down? It does. Has our O2? Yeah, I think we're okay. Let's just come down for a minute. And it just comes out the side. That's uh, incredibly boring is what that is. That's incredibly, incredibly disappointing. Is that it for this wreck? I mean, this is a big, big wreck to only have one thing in it like that. That's... Huh. Okay. Let's grab a little O2. And we've done it. And back in we go. Let's go again. Aha, a door. Sorry it's dark. Not a whole lot I can do about it being dark, but we'll get our... There we are. We're out again. Oh, oh. 
basic plant pot, ladies and gentle peeps. We've got anything else in here? Okay. Ooh, is this? Is this one of the? Aha! Uh -huh. This is one of our laser cutter doors. Let's get to it. Pop this bad boy open. Keep an eye on our oxygen. Oxygen. Thank you very much. Joy kill for the uh, the harsh words about making sure I have a laser cutter on me at all times. We've done it. Is there anything in here? What is this? Laser cutter fragment? Well, I, why would you need a laser cutter fragment when I have to have the laser cutter? Battery charger? We already have a battery charger. Uh, we did find one thing that I would like to... Oh, hello. What do we have here? Data box. Alt. Lightweight, high capacity tank. Nice. What do we hear? Propulsion cannon. I think this is the second one of these that we've got. It is. Oh, my. Oh, my. Okay. Let's, um... Hmm. Can we get outside through here? How's our O2? We got a minute of O2 left. I think we're okay for now. Okay. I don't want to get stuck. It felt like I was getting stuck there for a second. Let's head back over. Uh, grab a little more O2. Like so. Now, let's get back inside here. So this goes down. Let's uh, 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 let's go down. Passing 100 meters. Battery charger. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Battery charger. We don't need battery chargers. Okay, what do we get? Vehicle upgrade console. Very nice. What is this? Modification bay fragment. Yep. Oh, we already have it. Okay. Vehicle modification bay fragment. Very nice. This is uh, an absolute nothing. More water. Okay. Okay. We're good. We're good. More water, I'm assuming. Yep. May as well grab these while we're here. Okay. We got all kinds of battery charger stuff that we absolutely do not need. It looks like we're done in this area. I thought I saw just a... No, nope, we're done. Okay, let's uh, let's bail on out of here. Sand shark still freaking out. Nice, nice. I think that's everything in here. That's a cool looking thing. I'd kind of like to have that. Whatever it is. That's the way out. And this goes down and out. Okay, so we did it. That's uh, that's it. We've gone and done the thing. I don't see anything 30 else 30 seconds of oxygen remaining uh okay so that wreck is i was i'm gonna say it's uh, we put a put a cross through it let's keep on going here we're only 800 meters away and it goes deep 200 meters down uh let's get a repair on this bad boy we've done it how's our charge we've only got 31 percent of our battery left or our, our our power cell left okay so we're back in the mushroom forest biome uh, and over this way, a bit is where that we got that Leviathan warning, which I'm not all about. I don't know what they are, but I did see some... Hello. What is this? Okay. Alien vent. Oh, boy. Can we get sucked in? Not really. It doesn't really suck us in. Oh, Jelly Ray coming over to play with us. All right, let's, uh, let's hop back and see. That's uh, disconcerting. That means we are not alone on the planet, possibly. I mean, other than indigenous flora and fauna, is that a little bit of lithium I see there? It sure is. Okay. How's our inventories doing? We're doing. We're getting pretty full. Yeah, seeking fluid intake right now. Vital signs exactly. Perfect. We've gone and done the thing. Alright, where's the thing over here? 462 away. And at least 50 of that is down. Uh, okay. This is interesting. Check this out. We're pretty deep, too. There's another wreck over there. We'll go check that wreck out in a bit. Oh, this is... This is Leviathan territory, if I remember right. Oh, look at this! What is this? 
Can I scan it? Large bulb bush? Okay, can we... We can! I got a bulb bush! I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. Where is it? It's right here. Ooh, it's huge. Can we eat it? We can! Doesn't do anything spectacular for us, though. Oh! Oh, look! It's... It's... I don't know who it is. It's Thomas? And Amy? And Sarah? And what is that? So many things. I'm really deep. I gotta be careful. What is that? What are all these things? Oh, all these things. I gotta... I gotta... Oh. I can't get... So, oh, wow. Wow, I'm so sidetracked. Okay, where's our... Uh, where's the sea moth? Where's the sea moth? Where is the sea moth? I'm trying to. Seismic activity in the region. Not okay. So, thank you very much. Um, there's a wreck over here. We are still getting... We're still a decent ways away. Oh, it's loud. Oh, what is all this stuff? Look at... What is that? I gotta go check this out. Hang on. I'm assuming I'm gonna be able to scan it. Hey, buddy. Bone shark. Oh, you're annoying. You make weird noises. Okay. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. Hot gold action. Greatly decreased, so we're gonna have to move really fast here. What is this? Light stick fragment? Okay. Light sticks. Alright, where, where are we? What are you doing, man? Get out of here! It's my sea moth. Leave it alone. You're not so nice, I can tell. All the other sharks are a pain in the butt here, too. Uh, what is this? Scanner room fragment. Okay, we've already got that, but, you know. Light stick fragments. That should be number two. And nailed it. It's a cool-looking chair. Too bad we can't get anything out of it. There's nothing over here. Hmm. Okay, we're doing okay. That's a weird-looking fish. Where's the sea moth now? Why am I so lost? There's the sea moth. Man. Those reef packs make so much noise. Okay. Uh, another signal? Man, that's like the third or the second signal this episode. And we haven't even gotten to the one that was recently given to us, like when we arrived. Warning. Maximum depth Ooh. reached. Careful. Hull damage imminent. We don't want to damage the hull. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, whoa, 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 man, you're hurting me. What are you? Can I scan you, please? Can you come here? Ow, ow! Ampiel. Oh, he's peacing out. I'm, I'm peacing out. I'm not, I'm not freaking with him. Another one up there, and they damaged my sea moth. Oh, we gotta get out of here. This is uh, this is not okay. Okay, we're pretty deep. Let's uh, let's get on out of here. Where's our signal? Our signal's this way. We're gonna go. We're gonna go to it. It's so dark. I'm hurt. I'm gonna need food soon. Warning. Maximum nope. depth reached. No, we, we don't wanna. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Okay, let's just stop here for a quick second. Get a repair on. And we've done it. Okay, we need to leave. Oh, wow, look, that one's bigger than the rest. Okay. Oh, 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 okay. Uh, okay, so what we're after is down here. Here's Life Pod 12. Let's just bring Warning. it down. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Maximum depth reached. Just Hull damage imminent. Okay. Repair. Okay, now let's have a look at it here. So, I see... Okay, let's get to it. We're gonna have to be pretty quick about it. Yup, let's get to it. Repulsion cannon, very cool. And a PDA. 
Oh, look at that. I'm not really a doctor. I know that's what my ID says, but I never have been. Cheated the medical exams. What does a doctor these days need to know about manually resetting bones? When was the last time a top surgeon actually cut someone open? That's what the robots are for. Doctors these days read diagnoses off of computer readouts. For that, I'm perfectly qualified. But what good is it when I'm not connected to the main network? I'm bleeding. I've got glowing green pustules growing on my hands. What? I run a self-scan and it tells me I've got skin irritation. The only thing I studied in medical school was how to lie convincingly. What the hell do I know about how to treat an alien disease? I think I'm actually going to die down here. I hope not. Okay, so he definitely died because we saw his life pod. It was all smashed to smithereens. Um... Yeah, so... A lot of stuff. That's... So that's... I think that's what they refer to as, and I, I do know uh, what biome that is. It's referred to as the Koosh biome, which is kind of cool. Cyclops bridge fragment, ladies and gentle peeps. That is another piece of the blueprints, yeehaw, to get the Cyclops. Now, what else do we need for that bad boy? Let's check that out. It's down here under vehicles. Right? Vehicle upgrades. Is it just right here? Mo vehicle, mobile vehicle B. I'm um, wow. I'm just talking weird. Uh, modification station. Where is it? Cyclops. So we've got two of three. I don't know what the third one is. So we've got hull and bridge. Ooh, ooh, wrong button. So yeah, that's interesting. All right, let's head back to base. I'm gonna I'll pop back. We'll uh, we'll get some stuff put away. Get some food, water, repairs on. All that stuff, and I'll, uh, I'll BRBs, peeps. We're back. Just found this little wreck full of sea moth fragments, and I'm just a nuclear waste disposal unit. I guess that's the thing. Just figured I'd bring you guys back so we could, uh, rummage, it ar rummage around it pretty quick. I actually don't think there's anything else, which means it's an unbelievably disappointing stop. But... These, uh, these wrecks are starting to get more and more and more disappointing because, uh, we just have found so much stuff. And we're in such a good place. I'd really, really, really like to find... What is this? What are you? Time capsule. Okay. Let's open the time capsule. Uh, I don't know what it did. Press tab to view. Medical officer's log, alien data, blueprints, equipment, time capsule. That's still not what we're after. Alien data, fauna, time capsules. Here we go. So we found this time capsule here. Uh, I'm not 100% sure what that says. I, uh, I do not speak this particular language. But it looks like it gave us another scanner tool, maybe? Yeah, we've got two scanner tools now. Uh, I don't know why we'd have two scanner tools, but it looks like we have two scanner tools. Which means we're going to be able to rob a battery out of one of them. That's probably the most uh, exciting thing for me at that time capsule. All right, let's head on back. Detecting increased foreign bacteria levels in the water. Performing a self-scan is advised. All right, self-scan it is. When we get back to base, we'll perform a self-scan. Ah! We almost ran into the floater. And watch out for the bubble butt. I think we have some food back at base. If we don't, I'm just going to have to grab some stuff. A couple of peepers. And you know what? It probably wouldn't be a bad idea for us to just go ahead uh, and grab peepers and boomerangs anyway. Just so that we can have a couple. A uh, whole fish would do. Can, can I have? I guess I can't have the whole fish. And a boomerang over here. Come here, boomerang. No, I guess inventory must be full. That's uh, another possibility. All right, let's get up here. What is that? What is that? You guys see that? What is that? It's like right here. 
Oh! What are you doing, big fella? You stuck? You stuck in the wall, guys. That's that's sad. All right, let's uh, let's have a go with this. Let's get some food and water on the go. Looks like we're gonna need just where is food? Uh, get to uh, get us a boomerang and a peeper. Two boomerangs and a peeper. Nope, one boomerang, one peeper. Is that what we're getting? Very cool. Uh, so a boomerang and a peeper and a little more water. Okay, we should be all set. Let's, uh, I'll get this stuff put away, but in the meantime, let's have a listen to this. Aurora, we're approaching the planet now. We have a landing site oh. for you that's... Well, it's better than the alternatives. We've sent you the coordinates. It'll take us a couple of days to align our orbit. Should be able to establish direct contact with you during that time. Then we're coming in to get you. Cross your fingers, the weather holds. Don't leave us waiting. Send me out. Ladies and gentle peeps! That's a rescue! 39 minutes and 32 seconds. Right there! Only a thousand meters away! We've done it! We survived! But we're going to find out more in the next episode! I want to thank you guys very much for coming to hang out with me today. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to show your support. Smash the thumbs up button! Feel free to share the video around the internet as you see fit! And I'll see you guys for rescue! GG's peeps!